What is up, people? I am almost certainly real. Back at it again here. 20 minutes to dawn. Endless mode. Gonna see if we cannot make Hina go a little bit crazy in this mode. Um, I saw you can get multiples of every upgrade type. So yeah, we're gonna go for. We're just gonna go for a lot of lenses. That's the name of the game. And then I guess anything that increases my bullet damage. We'll take, I'll take a little bit of haste and magnetism. Why not? Those both feel quite nice. Um, but otherwise, just want to stack up the minion stuff and the magic lens. See if we cannot make our little dash character go a little bit crazy. Hopefully we get the thing that lets us attack a little bit faster. There is magic lens a level one. Definitely something we want to get here. Um, and we do obviously want to get the other summon stuff as well, right? Would it be quite nice for us? Especially once we get these lenses all going. I'm curious what happens with the uh, lenses. Um, if we can get, we can get a bunch of them kind of stacked up. I don't know that I really want to bounce that much. Let's go ahead and take a igniting a lens there. That gets us towards the beautiful focal point upgrade yeah i'll be curious to see how how the lens upgrades interact do we get multiple lenses do we get um yeah it's interesting we might actually not want to get more lenses if we get multiple lenses because we just want to get the focal upgrade type of thing potentially we'll see how it goes um let's see don't want refraction rapid fire i don't think that we really want right anger point is kind of fun to get i think i might get that i don't really care for attack speed although i think attack speed maybe affects my hmm yeah i'll take vitality and i'll work we'll work towards getting anger point because that's kind of a fun upgrade to get And re we'll use regen as maybe our source of uh, healing, whether or not we need it. Okay, so there is focal lane, focal point, and um, excuse me. Okay, I was I was like entirely possible that they've actually just patched this uh, interaction here. But it looks like not. We definitely want to get ourselves a bit of a summon attack speed there. Got to be a little bit careful with the grenades, shooting those out with, uh, yeah, just as I, I say that as I literally just hit myself. Um, and then another level of focal point. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, this is kind of what I was looking for there. Um, and then we want to get ourselves, obviously, some summon attack speed. Excuse me, excuse me. Uh, okay, we're actually just gonna lose. Um, let's get one of these placed down. There we are. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, not paying very much attention here, but would like to get some levels. There is some summon attack speed underneath my good ghost friend. I will actually have to worry about attacking because like if my grenade happens to go through it, um, my grenade will do like 10 trillion AOE damage, right? I'm trying to see like, can I actually shoot through my focal point? Just like, I'll just randomly shoot and maybe at one point we'll actually get it to go through, but I don't, I don't actually see it anymore. See what we get out of this boss here. Whoop. Ooh, okay. Yep. So right there you saw it go through the <laughs> Okay, I actually have to play. Uh I don't want, really want another ghost friend. Um Bullet damage up is obviously nice for us. Um excuse me, go off. There we go. What do we get chess wise? Attack speed, attack speed, attack speed. Yep. There we go. That's what we're looking for. Um, that makes our lives a whole lot easier as long as we don't die, even though we might. 
big shot. That is some fat DPS for us. Although I think her the, the summon attack speed might actually be based on our attack speed. Someone made a comment about that. I think that that might actually be true. So we'll see. We'll play around with it a little bit, but we got kind of our build on the line here. A little bit low on life. But I think pretty competent. 700 damage. We'll do reasonably well for the next little bit. We'll see at what point that starts to fall off. I guess we've got a. Yeah, I might. Uh, I might go run and pick up experience in another 20 seconds, 20, 30 seconds, because we got the five-minute boss coming out in a minute or less, and with <laughs> one HP left, uh, potentially some oopsies to be had. Uh, let's see here. None of that really matters to me. I Does it make sense to just get a bunch of ghost friends as well? I don't know that it does. We'll just crank damage here. Um... Yeah, we'll take a little bit of the percentage damage, percentage attack speed. Very nice. See, we're up to about 1,600 damage there. Ramping reasonably quickly. Although, uh, to be honest, I think... We'll, we'll see how it goes. I think Frost actually might be better later on. Um, potentially a thing in terms of, like, doing percentage damage. <laughs> yeah, that felt reasonably good there, though. Uh... Yes, I guess we just take this. I'm going to take a level of haste, though, if I'm to be honest. I uh, just would like that. Um, hmm. Bullet size. I don't... Yeah, the bullet damage is kind of okay, but we get so much of it. I don't think that it really matters. I'm gonna just going to leave those... Um, grab a little bit of experience here. Yeah, so we'll see how this endless mode goes. I played around with just kind of a little bit to figure out whether or not you could get chests and boss spawns, that kind of stuff. Um, I don't know if the bosses and the chests start respawning. Obviously, there's like... So there's the, uh, who's the person that like heals, gets damage on heal? That's probably one avenue. Um, and then ice is probably, ice feels like it's probably the best because there's just a lot of percentage, percentage HP damage, right? But we'll see, we'll see. This feels like it could be definitely a, a good choice. Oh, I should actually get the knife, right, for the summon damage. Gotta watch out for the eyes, or do I? I don't know that I actually do have to watch out for the eyes, because they seem to die here before they actually get to attack me. That is nice. Wouldn't mind getting another level in focal point for that, just to make that a little bit more reliable. Ooh, I almost totally dashed into myself getting killed. Uh, I might just take giant. I'm just going to do that because I don't want to lose right now. Um, I do not want to uh, play this over and over again. Yeah, let me take this because that'll let me play around with figuring out. So 50% is enough for me to tell whether or not my character... My summon uses my attack speed, which I think my summon does. Um, two additional projectiles. Interesting. I wonder if we get multiple ghosts. I'm kind of curious. Like, if I get a bunch of ghosts, can I... Will it apply to all my ghosts? We'll, we'll maybe play around with that a little bit. There we go. So I'm going to attack speed 50%. That's nice for us. Get those 
get those things. Ooh, okay, okay. We almost got hit by a, a ball there. Yeah, but if I'm standing still like this, then the uh, the eyeball guys can actually hit me, which is very nice. Um, I would definitely love to get one more into focal point. I mean, uh, basically an infinite number into focal point, but I think like one more would just be like super reliable in terms of like, even if I have to hit the eye guys two or three times, they would still get hit two or three times. You can see every once in a while my summon actually like shoots through my lens, even though I don't, yeah, I don't think I can see my lens. Potentially we could get multiple lenses though, like have like a infinite ring of lenses around us. Maybe getting a little bit of ahead of ourselves. So I, yeah, I'm a little bit confused about the timing because I'm like, wait, what, what's the timing? So this would be like the 12 minute timing, right? And I guess at 10 minutes, we would go and uh, pick this up. I'm very curious to see what happens on the um, post 20 minutes, right? Does like, do do we start getting chests and stuff again or do the enemies just ramp in, ramp in health very quickly? So we'll be, ooh, ooh, I dashed into them again. That was an oopsie on my part. I keep do I keep doing that. I'm gonna get holy shield. Um, cause I, I'm I'm just sitting here spamming. I'm spamming right click is like the only thing I'm doing. I'm not really paying very much attention. Um, igniting lens pretty pointless for us. Blazing speed that does get us towards in the wind, which is reasonably useful. So we'll, we'll go ahead and pick that up. Um, um whoa. Okay. Okay. There we go. Got to sort of slowly move myself around there a little bit. I don't know that I want the fire rate decrease. Oh, there's another magic lens. Kind of, I think that made it bigger. Oh no, so there's a, interesting. You can see we now have a another magic lens. Let's get another focal point there. Um, huh. Yeah, I don't know that, I don't know that they're both applying. A little, uh little confusing let's get multiple ghosts oh i need to get that summon damage we need to get the um we definitely need to Ooh, that is very satisfying two additional projectiles yeah let's check that out so are they just gonna both you can't actually see here they're both shooting a lot of projectiles Oh, I've, I can see my lenses now. And it seems like there's... How much damage am I doing? We're doing 9,000 damage. So I feel like whatever we just did worked out for us. That was a... Um, a set of upgrades that was good. But those lenses are looking a little, a little wonky there. One of them's pointing at me. One of them's just kind of gone sideways. But the ghosts are actually like... Yeah, the ghosts are actually getting enough shots through the lenses that they're... Oh, okay. That's only about 300 damage there on those hits that the ghosts are doing. Obviously for us at this moment in time, that's fine. But uh, so 10 minutes, we're gonna see the bigger guys show up. Yep, that makes sense. Still getting one shot. Um, bounce, no point, no point. Interesting, I'm kind of curious as does I'm just gonna YOLO into Frost Mage. I'm just curious if, uh, is, okay, okay, well, we can test it on a tree, I guess. Yeah, so my, my AOE thing is actually applying Frost. That, okay, all right. Well, we are, um, maybe I just wanna go insane attack speed on this then. That, that is just a very reliable way to apply an insane amount of frost. Um, magic lens. Yeah, sure. Let's see. Let's get another one going. Another one.
Okay, we're up to, it looks like, 19k damage. Also, we don't have the dagger upgrade. Um... Feeling a bit strong. <laughs> okay, all right. We'll just run around, pick up this experience. Every once in a while, I will right-click. Kind of ending these trees. Maybe we'll, what we'll do is we'll make this a forestry game. We'll go around and uh, hunt down trees. 12 minutes, we get another chest. Is that correct? Um, ooh, tempting to take frostbite, but well, I think we just always take focal point. Yeah, because that looks like 74,000 damage, which I think is a big number. Ah, yes, there was that boss. Uh, okay. That, I think, potentially, um... I didn't realize we could... So the chess it appears like the chess pool is kind of RNG. You don't get, like, the three chests. You get whatever chest. All right. Well. Um. Yeah. That is, uh... <laughs> I, I... Okay, like, I don't... Like, how long... Now I'm actually concerned, like, how long am I going to be here? There's a little bit of a, uh little bit of a thing but i am going to yeah i will actually i might i might we might be doing okay what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go ahead and jump ahead um i'm gonna i'm gonna put my feet up here and chillax uh and and watch some youtube and i will fast forward for this oh hi it's me acr from the future yeah so we we uh i I started playing with an auto clicker not gonna lie just set up right click um and let it go the curse bosses the curse aoe seems to get smaller i also figured out that freeze works with the uh hina aoe attack as well as those balls coming out from the ghosts so i picked up quite a lot of freeze at this point i kind of figured that goes sort of infinite in terms of doing percentage damage and i honestly like i don't know how much damage we're doing if you look at the enemies getting attacked like i think i want to say it's like tens of millions hundreds of millions i'm not sure exactly it's very hard to see the actual damage being done because we're attacking so fast that uh they just end up stacking on top of each other and we can't really see how much damage we're doing in terms of like optimal theoretical gameplay i think you'd actually be better off going with the faster weapon and just going all in on the freeze percentage damage because that basically scales infinitely if i'm to be honest i think that our uh i'll call it the ghost our right click attack speed is at the point where like the game engine can't really keep up we're probably kind of maxed out in terms of attack speed and yeah, what, what's interesting is there are these enemies that <clears throat> kind of seem invulnerable. You can see two of them there on the left-hand side that are just taking an insane amount of damage relative to the other units. I think there's some chance that like we've pushed those units over into like negative health or something like that, and they're rolling back over into positive health. I don't know exactly what's going on with those guys here. I decide um, let's get ourselves a little bit of experience. At this point, we've been like AFK, I wanna say at least 10, 20 minutes. I think there's some chests on the ground, some curses, and the game starts to lag super hard here. We're getting pretty insane experience considering the fact we are already at level 56. You can see the game start to slow down there. And yeah, that's where it rips, unfortunately. Um, I think basically we're kind of the point where I could have just left it alone and not gone and picked up that experience, which is a little bit disappointing. I don't think anything really could have gotten to us with the amount of freeze we had. I had at that point in the game basically 100% hit chance. I don't know exactly how the freeze stacks, uh, but yeah, obviously the endless mode, a little bit of balance stuff to figure out. but. It was kind of fun there to give that a try and I thought you guys might be interested in uh, checking out something that goes a little bit crazy. Anyways, 
Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.